Hello, this is Andrew, and this video is supposed to demonstrate some of the work being done as part of my uh, prelim results for my proposal. And all that's going to happen in this video is I'm going to load the uh, bitstream that contains the, the architecture of the baseline processor. But within the block RAM is actually a bootloading application where, using the host computer, I'm going to run an in-circuit serial program in circuit serial program that's going to load one of the applications onto the uh, FPGA here. And it's um, this is actually the VC707 and it runs uh, the Vertex 7. But just to demonstrate everything works, I'm going to start from the beginning. Turn on the VC707. Come over here and uh, load the application or load the bitstream. This is the Movado Hardware Manager. I'm probably going to skip through this when I actually demonstrate the video. And over here, I already have the command set up. This here should launch the application. So all it's doing right now is I have it set to verbose mode. And ver verbose mode is very real. So it basically prints out each instruction that's being written to main memory and the index of said instruction. Unfortunately, it kind of takes a bit but a lot faster compared to resynthesizing the entire design of new code. And like I said, I'm probably going to skip through this during the actual demonstration. So while that's running, um, this thread metric, uh, the application I'm running is a thread metric uh, application. Specifically, it's the one that uh, measures um, that basically quantifies the performance of preemptive scheduling. Unfortunately, there's no UART lights or there's no TX and RX lights to kind of show that code's being loaded. Right, at this point, the application's finished loading and now we can start the serial monitor. So, just to demonstrate things are working, I have it set up such that if I just hit a key, it returns that live uh, message. And after 30 seconds, which 30 seconds is not passed, it reports the uh, the, met, uh, the results of the benchmark. So, yeah, the, the information that you're seeing here is all coming from uh, the VC707. And essentially, it's printing the number of times it can, it can complete an operation within 30 seconds. And that operation has to do with uh, the thread metric port for their preemptive scheduling tests. Um, that's about it. It, can, it continues to run. So basically for all my results essentially, I'm gonna keep running this software so I get a bunch of these values. And once I have a sufficient amount, I'll use this for a comparison with the proposed architecture. Thanks to those who took the time to watch this and goodbye.